Good morning, dear friends. I've been in Tasmania. Uh, I was supposed to go again. Yeah, didn't you notice? Oh my goodness! <laughs> I was supposed to be there for like a Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and come back on a Monday with Grace. And the last thing that you saw was probably the Sunday that I spent hanging out with Grace. I cancelled my flight home, and <laughs> I stayed there. Yeah, that was two weeks ago. Yeah. You left two weeks ago today. No. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Well, I just got back and um, I did vlog during the trip, but so many things happened that I didn't find time to stop. I, you know how I always make this joke about like, I let the universe tell me what to do. I let the universe guide me. The universe did some Dirk Gently shit. And uh, what is it? What's it called? Dirk Gently's holistic. holistic detective agency. It was Pretty Pastel Please's holistic trip to Tasmania. Um, I can't even begin to explain how many things happened and I'm not going to try. So I'm just going to post those videos. Um, uh, if I get three of them edited in a day, I'll, I'll post it. Um, I'll just cram as many of them as I can. Uh, so things are going to be out of order. So I hope you don't mind. But before Dan leaves for work this morning, I wanted to show him my little bag of goodies that I got from Tasmania. It's a pigeon knocker. It's a dove door knock. So I thought for the Avery, we can put it on on the door. I won't put it on our front door, but I do. Here, look, just picture. You're like, pigeons, I, can I come in to feed you? <laughs> it's very cute. Okay, thank you. I was like, do something, I'm giving up. What, what, what's on it? What's it holding? It's holding a, a stick. Why? Maybe it's a dove with an olive branch? <laughs> I'm at the airport and I'm about to pick someone up and it's someone very exciting. Oh shit, wait, hang on, fuck. Oh, uh, now I don't know where to go. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Where do I go? Shit, 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 fuck. Alright, I've uh, shared my location with him on Google. So hopefully he can find me. Um, I'm just gonna put up my little D20 thing that I bought in Tasmania. And um, <laughs> I, 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 this is so funny because you guys are watching with absolutely zero context, like no context whatsoever because uh, I haven't edited the vlogs from my trip. But basically <clears throat> the person that I'm picking up, I've, met in the past week. Oh, there he is! <laughs> it's you! Hi. You're here! Hello! Hi. Sorry. Oh, I'm so, okay. I hate this place. Oh, it's, yeah. Have you ever been to Sydney before? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Right. This is Clay. Hi. <laughs> um, I feel very small. Would I be able to get you to navigate somewhere for us? Sure. Where are we headed? We are going to the car park of the Bunnings. Bunnings. All right. Well, you, you've you just become a D20 when you, when you put your... <laughs> Incredible, I'll just That's... <laughs> hide your identity mm. so no one knows who you just are. Just get it over one of my eyes. <laughs> I am Vecna. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming. It's all good. It's so good to see you. Are you wearing Zeke's pants? No, Arden's. Oh, Arden's. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, here, wear these. So I was like, all right. Very cool. Um, so I'm not going to tell you where we're going, but what, what, do you, what do you think when I say we're going to the car park of a Bunnings? What is the first thing that comes oh, to Oh, is this mind? a drug deal going down? Like, you know, like <laughs> what's happening? What sort of deal would I be making? It's burbs, isn't it? It may be burbs, perhaps. Incredible. <laughs> Could perhaps be burbs. Um, I, I won't tell you what sort of burbs. Mm -hmm. uh, you'll never guess what sort of burbs. <laughs> it's very un uh -huh. unlike me to pick up this particular type of burb from a Bunnings car park. <laughs> so I hope you weren't waiting too long. I was like, oh, no, yeah. I spent the entire time lost as heck. Yeah, me too. That's how I live, basically. <laughs> I, I, um, I, when I saw you, your flight was meant to land at 11.35 or something. And I was mm. like, okay, so hits the tarmac at 11.35. No, they were booking it. They oh, were. Fuck. <laughs> really going I for it. I was basing everything off like, ah, yes, 11.35, sit on the tarmac for 10 minutes, you know, like, come, have to get your bag, 
but then you didn't have checked on bags but still have to get out of the airport and there's always 10 million people and you're like dodging between them and mm -hmm. I was like oh you know I've probably got a comfortable 15 minutes before he gets out no instead I just I just left I left you there <laughs> feeling lost for like half an hour <laughs> oh, that's fine I hung around the uber people they seem just as confused <laughs> I was interesting. I would hate to be an Uber trying to pick someone up from this fucking airport, I swear to god. Also, I noticed that you do not have Uber in Tasmania. No, we have Uber. Oh, do you? Yes. Okay, so um, Uber's advertising is not inclusive because there was a sign. When I, when I was at this airport, there was a sign and it was like Uber, um, anywhere you're traveling or something. And it went Sydney, Adelaide, Melbourne. Perth, Brisbane, <laughs> and that's all it's saying. Look, the number of maps that just do not have Tasmania on it. <laughs> They're just like, go fuck yourself. You don't exist. Silly little island. <laughs> You're not part of the mainland, we don't care. Yeah, that's why we have our own currency. Yes, they do. Mm -hmm. It's called the uh, Tasmanian, De it's called Devil Dollars. Devil Dollars, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> and if you need to exchange your Australian dollars for Devil Dollars, mm -hmm. come and see me. Yeah, yes, exactly. <laughs> I'll get you a great rate. <laughs> it's uh, all... E, e currency. Mm. Um, you, you you have to download it an app. It uses the blockchain. Yes. <laughs> which means it's secure. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> I've been dealing in devil dollars <laughs> for many years. <laughs> um, anyway, I think I will. I'll turn off the vlog because we've got a little bit of a drive, and I I, I can't entertain people on the internet and entertain people in real life at the same time. It's physically. <laughs> I'm entertained. You're entertained? Yeah. Are you entertained? <laughs> Are you entertained? <laughs> so, I just left a voicemail for Sam and I was like, Samuel, it is of the utmost importance that you come to my house today. <laughs> it is uh, like there is someone, the very important visitor that you must meet. I will give you no other context. Because I haven't actually spoken to Sam since I came to Tasmania. Like, oh. since I met any of you guys. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I haven't spoken. He has no idea. So, he'll just be like, okay, I I'm expected at, at your place, alright. Don't know why. And then I'll be like, I present to you. Lay. <laughs> and then two seconds in, it, that, that's all I need to do. And then I'll just step away. And, and then just watch what happens. <laughs> watch Fireworks. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, uh, for your partner's sakes. Not <laughs> well, actually, no, no, I'm gonna. Dan, Dan is like, I might fall in love with this man from the way that you're talking about him. <laughs> I was he's like, I think I may have already fallen a little bit in love with him. He oh. sounds, he sounds great. Um, but we'll wait, we'll wait and see. I'm blushing, truly. <laughs> okay, we'll see you in the car park. <laughs> All right, so we're here. Uh, I, when I talk to people online, mm -hmm. um, I don't use my real name. Mm -hmm. I, I call myself Archie. Mm -hmm. So this person thinks that he's meeting up with an Archie oh, to I give some pigeons to. Oh, uh, he said he's in parking area D. Four. No, I'm not saying. Good. <laughs> D for <laughs> Dumbledore. Um, uh. <laughs> and he also told me his number plate, but I'm gonna let the universe guide me. Um, A. A. B. Wait, A for Alex. B for Ben. C for Clay, oh. D for Dumbledore. Can you go to that guy's window and pretend that you're Archie mm -hmm. and you're, you're picking up the... What's his name? I don't know. His, oh, his name's Marco. 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 For sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. Hey, Marco, just picking up the, the pigeons. Sorry about the delay. Yeah, I do. Okay. Throw, throw your friends in the deep end. This is this is the tri the trial of initiation um, for my friends. I I say that they have to pick up pigeons for me. Do you want the boxes? boxes? I need your expertise. Oh 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 okay. Pushing them in the boxes. As they are in a, quite a nice cage. Oh, they're in a cage, are they? Yes. Ah, okay, cool. All right, I've brought I've brought two boxes. I want to drive off so that I get out of the dude's way. Bye! He is not who I expected. Hey. The, the pigeon community is typically uh, angry old white men, but he was very nice. So pretty. So he said this. these are the last of his flock, mm -hmm. and he was just getting rid of all of his birds, and these are the last, last ones he had, and he wanted them to go to a good home. Mm -hmm. um, and I've always wanted fantails. Mm -hmm. So... My, my rule is, uh, 
you know, don't don't buy the animals that you want from a pet shop or anything like that. Mm. Not that they sell birds like this at pet shops. Oh, excuse me, lady. You... Mm. That's not in your best self-interest, I would say. To, no, but to, I mean, no. Oh, to mm. just walk onto the road without look. Okay, well, her husband had more sense. Mm. <laughs> he still has something to live for. <laughs> Year of the Dragon, though, you see. Ah, yes. Okay, now, we don't want them to... Hey, hey, apparently you're very placid, he said. He said that they... they... Oh, no, Hong Kong. Okay. Must be the male. Hong Kong, Hong Kong. This is an Indian fantail. There's many types of fantails, but Indian fantails have the little... The little, see the little thing on the back of their neck? Indian fantail, good, yes, very placid, nice. And, now if you hop, yep. Um, and the other one is also an Indian fantail, I believe, but might have a little bit of American fantail bred in. Oh, okay, all right. I think they'll do better if they, oh, you, good Lord, look how many fucking mice this bird has. Do you see? No. Look at that. They are all lice. Oh, goodness. You see all the bugs? That's okay. We'll get you fixed up. We'll get you fixed up. Alright. No, no, no. Okay. Hmm. I, they, I almost feel like the box is too... I was going to say too big. But mm. <laughs> look at that one. You know what? If they... It's up to you, but sometimes when I grab the birds, and they just, they like to just sit in the dark. That's okay too. You go down there, yes? Yep. Okay. 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 <laughs> you can sit on my leg if you like. These sort of birds don't fly. They are literally bred to not fly. They're bred to live on the ground and be like miniature peacocks. Mm -hmm. So, um, you, you <laughs> may need a shower when you get home if there's bugs on you. Mm. Do you consent to this? That's okay. Are it's, you sure? This is fine, I you, promise. Okay, alright. Um, it's and, very warm on my that's good. Okay, hey, buddy, you can stay right oh where you are. <laughs> the one, the one down here. Look. Hey. Hi. No one has to know you're there. It's fine. All right. We'll we'll just drive cautiously for. A... Oh my god! I just can't believe it. <laughs> Welcome to Sydney. So Incredible. You've been what an experience. You've been initiated into the friend group. Uh, yeah. so if there's a pigeon on your. Uh, on any of your body parts, it means that you've officially been initiated into the Pretty Pastel Pals. This is your initiation ceremony. You have passed the test. <laughs> You're so pretty. I know, they're the most beautiful birds. I can't believe the guy was getting rid of them. I'm like, but why? Why would you look at that bird and say, I don't want it anymore. I'm just gonna let it live its life with bugs all over it and just, <laughs> makes no sense. Okay. If I think about it too hard, I'll get angry, so yeah. I'm choosing not to. Yeah, well, I was saying, I was like, I seemed like a nice guy, but also then I saw the amount of lice, especially on this one. It's it okay, might... we're just moving a little. Yes. <laughs> the bird's like, what, what? what is this? Never never flown anywhere before, been stuck. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so cute. I am, I am very truly sorry. Okay, all right. You just think it's time to release the kraken. The kraken. <laughs> the kraken. Hey. Look, a friend, something. Someone for you to love. No, never mind. Yeah, fuck you, Chloe. <laughs> this is too wholesome. Simply too wholesome. Clay pigeon and pigeon clay. <laughs> Nod at him. Give him a little nod. Yes. If he nods back at you, you've been accepted. 
He's like, I'm considering your proposal. <laughs> the suspicion, the suspicion on his face. Errol! Oh, dumpling. Hey, dumpling. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dumpling. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dumpling. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I wonder how long until dumpling lands on your head. Dumpling. Oh, oh, oh. No, don't go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're doing pretty well. No one's flown away from you in terror. So that's that's a good thing. I think you've been accepted. <gasps> Progress. You have no idea how blessed you are, Clay. He doesn't let anyone do that. Hardly even me sometimes. <laughs> Dumpling. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, He must trust you because he's looking away. They don't normally take their eyes off the, the thing that's scaring them. So he's like, all right, he's all right. <laughs> More worried about that shifty dumpling fellow over there. <laughs> Lola. Oh. Lol. Lol. Lol, it's a rooster. <laughs> Mistake. <laughs> there you go. Yes, you, you must meet him. I wonder if he'll cock a doodle for you. Oh, here we go. Looks like he's, he's charging up. <laughs> Please don't, it's very loud. <laughs> He's doing a Kamehameha. <laughs> He's just waiting for the heart to come. We're friends now. Are we friendly? We're very friendly. It's all the nodding you're doing. They're like, huh, he speaks our language. So, uh, making friends? <laughs> could be friends we could be heroes <laughs> if just for one day <laughs> lola what are you doing where are you going Oi. very busy very busy no time to talk hi dumpling hi what are you doing hey my beautiful boy hi hey did you miss me oh, oh vibrate initiate vibrate hi what who's that Who's that handsome birdie? Huh? Oh, 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 okay, okay, I'm sorry. See, you must always trust the opinion of animals. And if Dumpling is sitting like this, it means that you aren't a threat. You must be a good person. It's because he identifies me as also a pigeon. Ah, yes, exactly. Same vibes, really. Oh, beautiful boy. Like <laughs> oh. All right, I've, I've, I've acquired a new friend for us to add to our collection. Is it a number is it a bird? bird? Is it a, is it no. Bird, is it a number? Oh, 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 here's something I prepared. Sam, I don't know who this person is. Well, nice to meet you. Oh, I'm stabbed for one. Is it a number? Is it a number? Is it a number? I've brought him here from Tasmania. I've been in Georgia. Maybe that was the place. Oh, Daniel! Clay! Oh, wait, you haven't met Clay yet? No. Oh, thank you. Pick'em. Where's the pick'em? No. 
Okay, well you better take a bad breath before you put her in the box. Or just like, oh, like do the cookie cake. You know? You say how to be playing, I will I'll I'll Oh, oh you can just sniff. No, no, I can do it. As soon as someone says something like that, do it in that moment, it will not happen. I'm the same. Yeah. Try not to procrastinate too often because otherwise I fall into the trap of it never gets done. Yeah. It doesn't work out. Either procrastinate or talk about it too much. It's yes. like, oh, I've got this cool project idea. I'm going to do this, this, and this. And now I've already thought it through and I know what all the steps are, so it doesn't interest me. Oh, you didn't tell them, did you? Tell them what? 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 No. Fuck, have I forgotten something? You guys are staying here tonight? No. No, no they're not. <laughs> no, he's, yeah. he's she, sleeping she, in the bed with me. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I was like, no, 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 this is me. 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 You don't do this in Tasmania. Yeah. 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 See the spark plug lids. There's eight of them. Because that's a straight eight. Uh, so these things normally had a four cylinder or a or a V8. So we had to cut the chassis, shift it forward, and then gusset it about another 30 centimeters to fit this in. And the other thing that's really interesting, I uh, probably can't tell from that picture either. It's got a radiator at the front. Yeah. Still overheating, so we ran a second water pump in line with the first that directs half the water flow to the rear of the car. So there's a second radiator laying flat under the rear, where water is being pumped through a second reserve, really to cool, to keep it cool. And now it's perfect. But the engine is from a World War Two boat. Yeah, for boat. 